This changes everything. Samsung is on a quest to make the Galaxy S25 Ultra the most powerful phone ever made. The Galaxy S25 Ultra will be powered by Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 with near desktop class performance thanks to Orion cores, along with a possible 4 GHz clock speed. But with all of this power comes great responsibility. A new report has come out saying that phones with Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 chip might require batteries up to 6,000 mAh capacity, which means after years of having 5,000 mAh per cell on Galaxy S Ultra flagship phone since the Galaxy S20 Ultra, we could likely see a massive battery upgrade on the S25 Ultra. Because the chips weren't as power hungry, Samsung never had the need to increase the battery. But now, with the AG Gen 4, they are pretty much forced to give us this battery upgrade in order to truly unleash the power of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4. And no, this change will not make the S25 Ultra chunky, because I've seen phones like Honor Magic 6 Pro with 5,600 mAh per cell, yet they pack the same weight as the Galaxy S24 Ultra. So, by utilizing an advanced battery tech like Silicon Carbon that Honor uses on their phones, Samsung can easily pack a huge battery without increasing the size. This also means we're likely going to see a battery performance never before seen on a Samsung flagship before. That's not all. The S25 series will undoubtedly bring the second generation of Galaxy I with some incredibly powerful features, one of which could be Google's upcoming chat model, the Gemini Nano. This is said to be the lightest version of the Gemini, which was designed to run on tablets and PCs, coming to phones in the form of Gemini Nano, and it could actually debut on the Galaxy S25 series. By the way, this news is coming straight from the executive director of Samsung Electronics. During a presentation, he confirmed that the next version of the Gemini AI model is coming to the Galaxy S25 series, pretty much confirming that the S25 series will be an even bigger AI powerhouse than the S24 lineup. And last but not least, Samsung has also officially unveiled the industry's fastest LPDR5X RAM that is optimized for AI applications for phones, laptops, and PCs. According to the official press release, this gives us 25% higher performance as well as 25% higher power efficiency, with 30% more capacity. Samsung will kick off mass production in the second half of the year, which means that we could actually see this on the Galaxy S25 Ultra, meaning all those AI tasks on the S25 series will happen extremely quickly. So there we go, that's all the latest news on what Samsung is cooking for the year 2025. Galaxy S25 Ultra is going to be one special phone, finally, potentially a big battery upgrade coming thanks to the 8 Gen 4's incredibly high-performing specs. Hopefully, this will happen. Again, I'll keep you guys updated with everything that is coming out in the world of Samsung news. What are your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comment section. We're now going to run through the full specs design and the expected pricing to help you guys decide if it is worth the wait for my regular viewers. You guys have seen this so just skip to the next video, but if you're new here then hit subscribe now, and we'll get right into it. So with the Galaxy S25, equipped with a 6.2 inch 120Hz dynamic AML LED display boasting a resolution of 2340x1080, shielded by Gorilla Glass Victus 2 for durability. For selfies, there's a 12 megapixel punch hole front camera. Turning to the back, the phone features a 50 megapixel primary camera a 12 megapixel ultra wide lens and a 10 megapixel telephoto lens. It will be powered by the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 or possibly the Exynos 2500. The device offers 8 gigs of RAM with storage choices of 128 gigs or 256 gigs, utilizing UXS 4.1 technology. The Galaxy S25 houses a 4000 mAh battery supporting 25 dB fast charging. Connectivity options include 5G support, Bluetooth 5.3, and Wi-Fi 7. Operating on One UI 6.1 based on Android 14, the phone is expected to be released in January 2025 with an estimated price range of $800. Now let's introduce the Galaxy S25 Plus, featuring an impressive 6.7-inch 120Hz dynamic AML LED display with an upgraded Quad HD Plus resolution of 3088x1440. It incorporates Samsung's advanced M13 OLED panel safeguarded by Gorilla Glass Victus 2 and reinforced with aluminum 2.0 for added durability. For selfies, a 12-megapixel punch hole camera takes the spotlight. 
On the back, you'll find a powerful camera setup with a 50 megapixel primary lens, a 12 megapixel ultra wide lens, and a 10 megapixel telephoto lens. It's equipped with the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 or the Exynos 2500. The phone offers a substantial 12 gigs of RAM with storage choices of 256 gigs or 512 gigs, utilizing UFS 4.1 technology. The Galaxy S25 Plus features a robust 4,900 mAh battery supporting 45D fast charging. Connectivity options include 5G support, Bluetooth 5.3, and Wi-Fi 7. Operating on One UI 6.1 based on Android 14, the expected price for this device is around $1,150. Finally, let's explore the flagship of the lineup, the Galaxy S25 Ultra, showcasing a generous 6.9-inch 120Hz dynamic A and OLED display with a crisp resolution of 3088x1440. It incorporates Samsung's advanced M13 OLED panel safeguarded by the durable Gorilla Glass Victus 2. For capturing stunning selfies, there's a 12-megapixel punch hole camera. On the back, the phone features an outstanding camera setup including a 200-megapixel primary lens, a 12-megapixel ultra-wide lens, a 50-megapixel 3x telephoto lens, and a 10-megapixel telephoto lens with an impressive 10x optical zoom. Contrary to earlier rumors, it is powered by the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 across all regions, distinguishing it from the S24 and S24 Plus, which stick with the Exynos. The S25 Ultra offers a substantial 12 gigs of RAM with storage choices of 256 gigs, 512 gigs, and 1 TB, leveraging UFS 4.1 technology. Housed within is a robust 5,000 mAh battery supporting Swift 45D fast charging. Connectivity features encompass 5G support, Bluetooth 5.3, and Wi-Fi 7. Operating on One UI 6.1 based on Android 14, this premium device is anticipated to launch with an approximate price tag of $1,199. Take all this info with a pinch of salt. If you find any mistakes or missing information in the Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra specifications, please tell us. We're working hard to make sure everything is accurate, but sometimes errors can happen. Your feedback helps us improve. What are your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comments section.